Hello everyone, welcome back and this is Naveen from UI Brains. So last class we have discussed about uh, the for loop with uh, some few basic examples. So in this video, we are going to see the same kind of example. We're going to convert them to the while loop. Okay, so you get the clear idea how to make a same statement in a, a for loop as well as while loop. Okay, so let's start now. So first of all, I create a separate folder. Okay, so 07-TS- hyphen so while loop. I create a new fresh uh, app.ts. Okay, fine. Uh, so first we have to understand the, the syntax of it. Okay, so while uh, loop. So syntax goes to be like this. Mm, first you have to initialize. Initialize and while you have to check the condition here inside of the while you write all the statements and the last statement goes to be increment or decrement increment or decrement should be always a last statement okay so increment and decrement should be the last statement uh, so this is because uh, you know in for loop also we have the same thing right so initialization condition increment decrement and statement so four things same four things in different order first initialization then you check the condition if condition success you gonna execute the statements and lastly you have a increment and decrement so it will check the condition execute the statements then increments the value after increments go and check the condition again if it is true execute the statements again then increment condition statement increment condition statement looping if condition fails come out on the file loop that's all okay let's take an example of uh, what so print again same same example because you get a clear clarity when between uh, for loop and while loop how to make a same example so print uh, values from what is that 0 to 10 okay let's see Mm, first initialization so let i of type number is equal to 0 okay now while loop condition up to what i less than or equal to 10 value next what is your statement i can just make console dot log of i value okay next increment the value this i plus plus that's all check it out you right click open terminal uh, ts uh, node app.ts enter yeah i got the values 0 to 10 if you want to print them side by side you can take let results of type num uh, string is equal to empty string empty string what it says you cannot redeclare the block scoped variable results why it is looking for a block scoped man? This is a different uh, file, right? Something weird. So, 0, 04 result is there, of course. It's a different file, right? Mm, something wrong. Okay, let's say value. Okay, happy. It's not supposed to be. You can take any variable. So separate file right uh, so value plus is equal to backtick i write the i value right so let's say console dot log of the value okay so run the program yes you got it okay same thing uh, can i print the value from print the values from uh, 22 0 with the difference is 2 here the difference is 1 okay so let's say uh, but i has been declared in the global already so i can just say i value 20 initialize and value i'll take it as empty instead of result i'm taking the variable called value okay but don't feel like value is a value it's a variable name uh, 
let's say result you take or okay okay fine does this value uh, so 20 right so while condition what is the condition i greater than or equal to 20 sorry 0 and then uh, same thing and then i minus equal to 2 that's all console.log of value correct check it out yes you get the same answer that's fine uh, next I want to print print the stars okay what type of stars let me grab that here yes this is the one copy I'll paste it here print stars so how I print the stars is um, can I do one thing can I get this here so this is uh, a previous thing right so what I do is um, convert this to while loop okay how I do mm, you write like this i is equal to 1 initialization this i is equal to 1 initialization here and then while check the condition i less than or equal to this guy and these are all the statements and finally i plus plus that's all so statements i kept here and i plus plus i kept in the last that's all delete next uh, this for loop also convert so i say j is equal to 1 and the while so here condition so j less than or equal to i and the statement and then j plus plus that's all and we don't need this for loop that's it so i guess now fine but not result no value okay let's check you get the starts okay and if you want to print the value from numbers like this yeah if you want to print the numbers like this same statement only thing you replace the value in the place of star you make uh, I guess you make the value call i okay I guess that's fine let's check yes so we made a while loop inside a while loop to print all these numbers okay so that's it uh, so enough for this while loop and uh, so next video we'll see the do while so thank you so much for watching and we'll meet in the next video thank you